what it do youtube it's your boy give me a buzz back with another grand blue video and today i'm going to show you what build i will be using for the raid and for Narmaya. it's pretty much going to be the same well yeah well, I said for Narmaya. but anyways pretty much going to be the same same thing i showed last time except we kind of added just a little bit different stuff just a little bit the only thing we changed is I think it was this damage cap nibble onslaught so now we have max nibble onslaught for the extra invincibility when we do a perfect dodge sba gauge and skill cooldown and that's pretty much about it but i do have a part two to the build so say it gets uh i probably should say this actually save current load out over yes all right there you go. but uh let's look go to this ah, it. all right all right i'm gonna just put it on right now uh do 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 okay so one of the things i'm just gonna be adding which is very very simple actually is we're gonna take one supplementary damage off and we're going to add and if i could find it whenever i get through all these damn approved dodges and these other useless sigils there we go fly over fight reason we're going to use fly over fight is well all right so the level of the way damage cap works is like we're generally going to be hitting for so much damage to the point where we're going to be at, my, at our damage cap already so let's head to the docks so i can show you okay cypher like we're just gonna do so like it, you do so much damage to the point you don't have to worry about it you're probably gonna be missing some damage cap for your skills or whatever but just get the one that mainly depends on your Rage character the tigress. Suffer her claws. so 50k or 49k well, we're hitting around 50k though now if we was to take uh add in something else like uh let's do crit crit rate more stamina with crit rate stamina i should have a crit rate with stamina do, 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 do. i have a level 15 but i don't want to take it off my fair right now and we're, we're, i mean yeah there you go uh perhaps we start changes cool oh, and now with that little stamina part we have we should be doing yep our max our max is fifty two thousand, but that's how that's the damage cap so i so generally i could always keep flight over fight on if you if i wanted to but the thing is the only reason we're damage cap right now for don't well the only thing we're damage cap for will be mainly our normal attack damage caps and our sky Mount art that's the pretty much the only thing. I don't have skill damage cap, but if you get skill damage cap, you'll you will be somewhat fine. Fire's damage cap wise, so you don't have to worry about it as much. But yeah, that's what I would change. Honestly, if I could be honest, I might say this is even better. Far as like sigil wise, because most likely, if if you're doing this solo, you're gonna have a support on your team, like a Cagliostro and or something like that now let's just do a time attack just to show how much we could do i'm gonna time attack i'm sorry uh i think i'm pressing every wrong button the tigress. let's do a score attack like we did was 27 minutes with narmaya i haven't really went to build all the bus characters yet okay we do this Death so yeah, we think I'm at. Got her. The butterfly. In a flush. We do this. There is no light. We do this. Got her. I feel like on the hill. Uh, yeah, like we're not hitting our damage cut with our with our skills, but we are hitting our damage cut with our attack. I probably messed up with a, a lot of rotations too, actually. Succumb. With the 
But this is still not bad there, like for a minute. Please slide off a fight too, so I like a like fool. Scatter! Scatter! Alright, so we did 16 million with the flower fight. Now, let's add it. Let's put on the stuff I was using. Destroy attack. The Where we are damage cap for literal everything. Free flutters dance. dance of the pink petals. Got her. Okay. To breathe. Huh? We await foam on the sea. You're okay. Huh? The butterfly. Enough. All right, so we're already hitting more damage. The cloud. Oh, we are very lucky right now. The pond. You're okay. Without darkness. Huh? Mm, 28 million. That's our new record. So we did 28 million with flower with without flower fight, but 16 million with the regular. And I feel like I bet, like I said, I, that's for me probably most likely messing up on rotation because the other stance. I think it's like the free lighter stance. Keep making the name of it, but the purple stance or blue stance. Uh, yeah, it was nine million of that. But either way. More so, more damage obviously without using flower fight, but I'll 100% still recommend flight of a fight just because of the fact because if the uh boss rate if the raid boss is that difficult, then yeah, you're going to easily, 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 easily want to fly a fight, especially with you, you know, doing, doing as much damage as possible. And everything plus. You don't want to be damage cap for everything, so you might as well just free up a slot. And yeah, that's pretty much about it. You just want to free up a slot, because why not? But uh, that'll be it. That is my not my build video. I'm coming up with another build video soon for other characters. The next character is going to be Fairy. I just got to get all her stuff maxed out. Got to get used to her playstyle still. It's not difficult, though. But the video will be coming out for that soon. But I will see you all later. Peace out.